In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix Rainbow Six Siege mouse cursor bug. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna talk about the mouse cursor bug, why it happens, and I'm gonna present various possible fixes to this issue. You will notice that currently I am on the training grounds and I don't have the bug active. This is because I don't want to grief my team, so I didn't queue up for unranked or a ranked match. I'm only doing this video to present the actual methods that you can use to fix it and why it happens. So as you might be aware, this is a very old bug that has been in the game for possibly years and Ubisoft still hasn't addressed the issue. As you might be aware, sometimes your mouse cursor will basically get in stuck in the game window and even though you can access some of the menus, maybe you can even scope in, you will not be able to aim around. So the easiest and most basic fix to this, as you might be aware, is restarting the game. Of course, this sucks because Restarting the game means that for one round, at least your team is going to have one person down and they might report you for leaving, griefing, you might get penalized, whatever, and it's not really good to do, especially if you are trying to do ranked matches. So besides this obvious method, what else can you do to fix the mouse cursor bug? The first method that a lot of people recommend is spamming escape, which brings up the menu at the top right corner of the screen and very click quickly going into the options. Usually, you have to spam escape until you are able to frame perfectly click on options. It would look something like this until you can eventually access the options. Inside of the options, sometimes you will be able to just close it and go back to the game with the issue fixed, and other times what actually happens is that you will be stuck inside of the options and you won't have this menu or the option to move your cursor to go away, possibly because the mouse cursor is stuck like in-game, so you can't change the menus inside of the options. But all you have to do is wait for the next round, which means that you are going to be dying for at least one round, and eventually, once the next round starts and you get other HUD information, for example, the option to pick your agent, change loadout, etc., you will be loaded back in with the mouse cursor bug automatically fixed, now, like I said, these are the two main ways of fixing this bug and mostly it is Ubisoft's fault because they still haven't addressed this issue. It's very unfortunate that players cannot reliably expect to get a good match because of this bug that happens randomly, but as of today, these are the only two known reliable fixes. So restarting the game and it's it's going into the spam escape method into the options. For the last one, some people recommend that you start the match holding right click, which means that you start the match scoping in right away and right after you one scope, the glitch will not be able to happen and you will be good to go for the rest of the match. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Rainbow Six Siege mouse cursor bug. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.